Sarah has assembled the group to make an announcement. She introduces Stacy as a temporary member to help during the busy spring break week. Sarah then communicates to the group the specific roles and responsibilities of each member. She assigns Kelly to the head bartending role, which is responsible for walking the floor to take drink orders and deliver them. Miles is tasked with working the bar and ensuring it is properly stocked, as Stacy is responsible for assisting Kelly and Miles as necessary. Now that the roles have been defined, Sarah begins to communicate the goals and objectives for the week and how each person contributes to these. As this is officially a formal group, this is the first time they have all been on a team together. It is the first evening of operation for the new group, and some confusion arises regarding each person's expectations or their interpretation of. Kelly, as head bartender and the most senior employee, feels that all the menial tasks she has to do should be completed by Stacy. So Kelly is frequently calling out to her for her assistance. Miles has a similar understanding of the expectations as he calls out to Stacy with the same frequency to keep the bar clean. Sarah happens to observe the situation and immediately takes action. She calls the entire group into her office to reiterate each person's responsibilities and reinforce that Stacy is at, is at scene to help not to do their jobs. It is the second night of operation and the team appears to be norming as the behaviors of the group are positive and promote cooperation. Sarah observes this enhanced development of the group and decides to challenge the group to see how they will respond to it. Sarah has an impromptu meeting with the group and alters the responsibility of Stacy and asks her to help serve on the floor and at the bar as the number of people fluctuate between them. Initially, Miles and Kelly showed signs of apprehension toward this, but immediately accept the change as their confidence in Stacy has grown. It is just the third night that the group has worked together. Sarah is impressed with the team cohesion, coordination, and positive behavior of the group. This is also noticed by the patrons, which is creating an exciting and fun atmosphere. At this moment, Sarah finally realizes she is not directing a group anymore. She has a high-performing team now.